It took forever. A whole fucking long ass goddamn four hours. But we finished. We were bleeding from every hole and all of our knuckles were broken. Not from fighting, but from knocking so hard because holy shit, we just made the game to end all games. So we grabbed his laptop, the leisure machine, and took La La Land 2 to the streets for anonymous testing. And I would just grin with pride watching the bouncing and falling letters on the start screen in the constantly shifting rainbow meme debugging background and the waterfall with nightmarish images that I wasn't sure were actually there. Or maybe it was just the game being characteristically holy shit did i spell that right that looks so wrong glitchy the first person we brought it to was just so antsy bouncing on my feet dancing around the street and he started up and what the fuck like flashing before eyes bright light baby daphne little daphne teen daphne oh here i am conscious again what is this knife in my hand what the fuck I'm on a goddamn battlefield and there are corpses all around me and Meowsbo is crucified screaming with timers on his wrists your last sight will be your lover's dying screams that's my cat that's a sound I'm gonna slit his wrists before I kill you what the fuck this is crazy so i'm running through puddles of blood and i hide behind a pile of mangled corpses to try to think of something to do and where the fuck are the guns why the hell is everyone fighting with fucking knives and spears and wooden handles of different sizes and with metal sharp shit of different sizes attached i mean it's like mexican food right it's all the same ingredients in different shapes who the fuck is this guy where there's some bubbling guttural noises oh god someone on the bottom of the corpse pile is alive and talking to me so i try to pull him out but the corpses just fall on top of me, and holy shit, it's really warm and heavy and kind of nice. But, uh, and it's, it's, so I just sit a while and listen. No, I don't. The guy just gets out, and he's got the general on the other side, and he wants to kill me because of my game. So I dig my way out of the corpse pile and pick out the flesh and blood from under my fingernails, because even in war, I fucking hate having dirty goddamn fingernails. And I just freeze. In horror, because, oh my god, my enemy is a fucking nutcase. He, like, cuts his dude's lungs out of his chest and then pinches the dude's nose and shoves a chill throat and pours water. Oh, god, lungs swell up and explode and the guy is just sitting there watching his fucking lungs swell to the point of murdering him and then this fucking guy he put a man in the center of a circle of like six other guys and cut out each of the surrounding guys intestines and wrapped up the center dude with them until he was just an intestine mummy all you could see was his head and then one by one he reached in the inside circles assholes and pulled out their colon and intestines from that end super fast so the guy in the middle spun around and around and he was yank yanking the six guys intestines out through his butt the guy in the middle puked up his own stomach, so the evil general punched the guy's stomach, and his stomach acid exploded all over Dizzy Dude, and just ate his flesh away. He died, too. They were all dead the whole time. Psychopathic murder. My enemy, who I was obviously supposed to kill to save my boyfriend, or, uh, Meowsbo, was just laughing with glee and splashing their blood. Oh, wait, he's distracted. Look how happy he is. I dash up behind him, hella quick ninja stealth-like, and cut out his entire spine. I just slit all the way up from his butt to his neck to pull that fucker out. Oh, man, this is fun. And I clip it around my waist like a belt, but it's really fucking long, so I hula hoop it for a bit and set Meowsbo free and we get ready to go home but I get arrested what the fuck I just killed a psychopath but they think I'm the psychopath because my stupid spine hula hoop and all I can think is you stupid if you just made it skip it they totally have believed you but this belt makes you look like a fucking nutcase stupid stupid always skip it never forget but I'm back now